I am going to fuck shit up <laughs> for the next three hours. Yeah. I'm going Bruce Springsteen set tonight. <laughs> Hi. How are you? I love you. Oh, that's sweet. I really that's sweet. love you. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> we'll have no more of that. <laughs> Toronto, this isn't a fucking Justin Bieber concert. Yeah. Jesus Christ, give me some credit. I'm a 40 year old man. Wow, it's hot. Take it, girl. Take it, girl. Stop, stop. I'm just gonna nip it in the bud. Stop it. Come just hang out after the show a little while. Play cool for now, okay? I have a certain reputation to uphold. Michael Showalter, I um, just wanted to ask you uh, about your book. What was it? You have a lot on your plate right now. I mean, you're doing uh, you know, TV stand up uh, teaching as well. Yeah, yeah. And uh, you decided to uh, write a book. What was it that made you. Uh, whoops. Want to uh, want to write a, a book? Sorry. Um, well, uh, I suppose it would be the same reason that anybody would want to write a book. I had things I wanted to say, right. opinions, uh, points of view, uh, moments of silliness, and uh, and I was uh, given the opportunity to write the book, and I said, sure, why not? Let's go for it. Um, so there you go. Did you uh, do you have like any s strategy uh, for writing? Like, there's an uh, um, internet thing about Jerry Seinfeld that's gone around the internet about don't break the chain. He, you have a calendar up, and he'd make an X on every day that he actually did some writing. And he, you know, once you sort of extend that chain, it feels good to have done work. You know, and do, do you have anything like that that you do? Oh, like a process? Yeah. Um, not really. I, I when I have, I for me, it's just when I have time I write so it's mostly just if there's whenever I can I do it um, I wish I was more disciplined like Jerry Seinfeld but um, for me it's mostly just uh, trial trial by fire right yeah so basically well you're so busy anyway that you really you're just sitting down to do it you don't really have to force yourself because it's whenever you have free time I guess That's yeah I, I did a lot. Of, I wrote most of the book in three separate chunks, where I sort of had a couple months here and there, and I tried to do the bulk of the writing in that, in those months. Oh, I see. So you're, I mean, as far as that, like, I guess that kind of extends naturally out of your, you know, your screenwriting. Did you, like, what happened first? You, were you a stand-up comedian first, and then? My background was in sketch comedy, and then um, after that, moved into making a couple films, did some screenwriting. Yeah. Um, and then went back to television uh, and did a couple scripted narrative shows. So then I did sort of a little bit of everything. The stand-up comedy thing has never really been in the forefront. Um, um, but over the years, I've done some touring around and performing. When did you start teaching? Uh, I began teaching about eight years ago. I was teaching um, sketch writing at an improv theater in New York City called the People's Improvisational Theater Company that also had writing classes. And then I've been teaching at NYU Graduate Film School now for five years. And I teach uh, all the different screenwriting classes. Um, and uh, it's been great. It's, um, it's a nice sort of steady gig um, to counteract the insanity of the industry as a whole. Do you find that teaching is like in its in and of itself kind of a performance as well? I do. You have to be on, right? Completely. You, everyone's relying on you and you, you have to be in control, you have to maintain control and you can't get distracted and um, so yeah, it's definitely, there's an ab absolutely a, a performative aspect to it that I really enjoy. Mm -hmm. um, three-hour classes and you just kind of, um, I don't lecture, so it's not like I'm giving lectures on subjects, it's a workshop environment, but, um, but when I'm, when we're talking about the material, I'll get into character and hem and haw and hoot and holler and all that stuff.